Okay, so here we are at the entrance to Holiday Inn Express Chindao City Centre. Let's go in and take a look at the lobby area. So we've got a map of Chindao here. Uh, not really in English, but hey. Oh, it's time to go see the light show. Okay, so here we are checking into Holiday Inn Express in Qingdao in China. Let's have a look. Looks like a standard Holiday Inn room. So for bed, I spot some slippers down there, got a little couch, TV, even found a wife in here. Okay, there we go. Just a standard bathroom, but just enough for what we need for the two of us anyway. The universal chargers next to the bed are a very nice feature. Also have USB ports as well. I was able to plug my Australian one straight in there last night. So really handy. I love it when hotels have universal plugs. We've got tea and coffee provided, which is always nice here. Uh, I can't say much about the view here. It looks like this building has been repurposed at some stage because there's this window here, but there's also windows on the outside. There's a few buildings out here, but the windows are really, really dirty. So I certainly won't be opening my window for a view. Okay, let's test the TV out. Uh, I'm not expecting there to be any English channels, but we'll see. I really wasn't sure that I was going to find any English channels at all. I mean, who knows in China whether they actually had them or not, but I was flicking through channels. Channel 1, nothing. Channel 2, nothing. Channel 3, nothing. Channel Mostly when you're overseas, you get BBC or CNN and I'm... Oi, actually, we found one. World Today in Beijing. Okay. So 16th channel is in English. looking at the little nooks and crannies here in this holiday in room and uh, I found this. Do we need a gas mask? Is there going to be a bombing here in Chindao? Or a fire? Who knows? But we'll put that one back. We also have an iron and an ironing board. So plenty of facilities here. Okay, so we've arrived at breakfast here at Holiday Inn Express, Chindao City Centre. Actually, really good variety of foods for Holiday Inn Express. We've been to a couple before in Australia. Got the usual bacon and sausages, fried rice and noodles, some chilli chicken, more noodles, dumplings in here, eggs, a couple of different stir fries actually. Got some pippies here uh, because Chindao's near the ocean, so definitely have them. This chicken stir fry was fantastic. Chicken nuggets, potato, different lots of soup, baked sweet potato soup, millet congee, white fungus soup. Got an egg station like all good places do where you can get omelettes, fried eggs and for us thankfully we have a coffee station. Maybe coffee station is not working. Nope, we have a problem, Houston. Nope. Rebecca backed away slowly from the coffee station. She broke it. <laughs> so we got some sweets, some bread, toasts, cereals. So, yeah, actually really impressed. Probably better than Holiday Inn breakfast I've had in Australia at Holiday Inn Express, to be honest. Okay, so we're in the laundry room here at Holiday Inn Express, Chindao City Centre. We're about to do some washing. They've got a uh, four big washing machine dryer combinations as well, are they? Yeah, I think so. They're all free, 32 minute cycles. No, I think this is the washing machine and the dryer. Okay. Well, the washing machine has a 32 minute cycle, so which is pretty quick and good, so you're not hanging around all day. Uh, they supply dishwashing, dishwashing <laughs> detergent. It might be a bit soapy for our clothes, wouldn't it? <laughs> okay, so. Let's just push start and the detergent automatically goes in it, I guess. Well, it does say up on the. It does say up on the um, washing 
operating. Um, pop. Do not wash clothes. Put clothes and close the lid. Laundry detergent will be added automatically. Excellent. That's fantastic. Let's go and find the gym. Nope, that's the kitchen. Still the kitchen. Oh yeah, here's the gym. For people who want to work out. It's only basic, but Holiday Inn Express generally is basic, so we've got two treadmills and a rowing machine. Do we have any weights? Nope. Okay, so pretty basic. What's the view like from the gym? Nothing to write home about. Unless they clean the windows, then it might be okay, but I wouldn't suspect so. So, so yeah, just basic. One thing I really like about this room at a holiday in Chindao City Centre is the air conditioning. It gets really hot in Chindao, so even at the start of September, it's been nearly 30 degrees every day and really a lot of humidity. So you come home hot and sweaty after getting out there and exploring, and I've had the air conditioner set to 16 to 20 degree range, depending on the temperature of the day, and the room has stayed absolutely amazingly cool, which is really good in the hot weather of China. Taking a bit of a uh, nap here at our Holiday Inn Does in Chindao. Just because I'm technically a little bit cold. I'm fully dressed. I think if she stayed there long enough, she'd taken that. 100%. So what are the beds like here? Um, I'm finding the pillows are fine, but the bed is a little bit hard. After walking all day, like, I'm finding my hips are a bit sore when I wake up the next morning. So, but other than that, look, it's, they're pretty comfy for me. You don't like the pillows, though, do you? I don't like the pillows much, but we sort of find in a lot of places in Asia they have firm beds anyway, so. Yeah. But other than that, it's fine. Like, it's not hard to sleep in or anything. It's just a little bit firm if you've got a soft bed. Some kind of Chinese cabbage. Yep. Some dumplings. And then they fresh cook the wontons where they do the eggs. And I've got some watermelon and some cake. What do you got, Annie Rosie? <laughs> <laughs> Yogurt, watermelon, wontons, and cake and risotto. Excellent. So for people who don't eat much Asian food, is there enough food here? <laughs> yes, there is. <laughs> okay. Excellent. Okay, so everything's packed up and uh, our time at Holiday Inn, Chindao City Centre is coming to an end. Rebecca Lord, what did you think? Yeah, it's a nice hotel. Host, uh, nice hotel. <laughs> <laughs> we enjoyed our stay here and we'd definitely come and stay again.